for the serious gamer. Hey, it's Spider-Man NextGenTactics.com. This is Meg, Season 1, Episode 10, Quick Win in Sabotage on Offense. It's going to be a short one. Uh, our faction kicks some serious ass. That's right. Sever, man. Sever all the way. So our target's A, and it actually looks pretty good here because all our squad mates seem to be going to A. I'm finding that a lot of times, even though the target is set to A by our squad leader, or actually by default, I mean, these guys are running to, you know, we've got guys going over to B, you know, they're just camping over at B, I don't know what the hell they're doing, but, you know, they're obviously not helping us very much at A. So I'm getting smoked, actually, I, I can't actually wait to um, unlock, I guess it'll be the equivalent of uh, Juggernaut, but uh, added health, it takes takes quite a few skill points to actually get to it because it's at the bottom of the skill tree so I think you have to spend probably like 14 or 15 skill points in total um, to get it but it would be a nice addition I don't know how exactly how much additional health it gives you but we'll see we'll see eventually we'll get it so we're actually actually we're squad leader so as you can see all you can do are set the uh, the targets and you just want to keep with default um, but again usually in sabotage you just you, you want to try and rush the targets I mean I, I I don't know I see too many guys just sitting back and going in the outskirts and killing guys that are in the outskirts without actually trying to go in and uh, plant the bomb or secure the uplink okay so once you have them both secured simultaneously that's when you open up your uh, C objective now a good strategy here, and I've seen people do it. I've, you know, when I'm on defense, I actually look for it, especially when um, the enemy is controlling one uplink. I'll actually go to where the C target is going is going to um, open up and check for enemies. So if you're on defense, you know, um, we're actually checking, we're checking the area that C is going to be at. Um, before they actually get both A and B because oftentimes you'll find guys camping in there just waiting and as soon as C opens up they're already um, securing or uh, uh, planting the explosives at the data center so um, so like I said you know a, a good thing you might want to do on on offense so we're gonna try it um, once we get some more uh, uh, team members on our team here or in our clan um, we're actually going to try some of that where you can, you know, just send two or three guys in to see before we actually capture both uplinks. Maybe even set up some uh, defenses or whatever. Um, so, yeah, the best thing you want to do here is uh, try and throw off your grenades if you can. Uh, remember not to uh, throw them at your teammates. And then rush it. I mean, you're not going to get anywhere by holding back. And this is what we're doing here. We're rushing up there. Kind of trying to heal ourselves a little bit ourselves. But it's really frustrating when you're trying to do that and no one's coming with you. <laughs> and they're all hanging back. So we end up uh, getting a few guys up here and we are going to arm the explosives. Alright, so now we gotta defend and I get hit. And we get saved. Sweet. The uh, the actual medical kit is kind of hard to use sometimes because it's not... Uh, now they defuse. What the hell? Come on. Because um, a lot of times I'll, I'll be pointing at somebody to use it on them and I'll end up using it on myself. Or I'm trying to use it on myself and end up spraying it on my teammates. So it's a little, it's a little bit awkward. Um, maybe they should have made two separate buttons to actually trigger it. One, two actually heal you and want to heal a teammate and uh, the other thing that's actually kind of glitchy on and you won't see it on this map but it happens occasionally if uh, your teammate is in water um, if they're submersed or almost submersed in water you can't actually heal them even though it shows them bleeding out you can't actually heal them with the medical device which is unfortunate so it looks like uh, we got it I mean I don't see any enemy blips in here and uh, that's it we got it so that's a quick uh, game of sabotage, and um, yeah, good win for Sever.
Not sure which faction we're actually uh, fighting against, but sorry guys. That was hilarious. All right, let's see what kind of XP we get here. I'm a fast one. Yeah, I lead. Slept on that. I'm like level nine. <laughs> All right, 104. Yeah, that kind of sucks. All right, four kills, five deaths, three streak. All right, so that's it. Quick game of sabotage for you guys. We'll have more stuff coming shortly. Visit nextgentactics.com for more strategies and more tactics and more of everything. I'm Spiderbite, and I'm out.